<laughs> Shit's lit was gonna be the Silver Surfer vaporizer, but Shaw twisted everyone's arm that we should try out this tea. Mm. Although I think you've been trying it out already, eh, Shaw? Yes. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Stop with me quickly, Shaw, and tell us about it. Yeah, man. Captain. <clears throat> <laughs> Somebody uh, stole the other jar or took it. Um, but this is the chocolate cream cookies one. I don't know if there's a camera for it. Mm -hmm. But uh, they come in these neat little bags, and there's quite a lot of we uh, weed in here, and there's nothing else mixed with it. It's quite pure. Yeah. So I would put it in a big mug and I'd add some uh, milk. And that's how I had it the first night. But I have my own way of making my own wheat tea anyway. So what I did then the following night was open the bag, take it out, and put it in a mixture of milk and water. <clears throat> and I find that uh, soy milk works good because it doesn't make a skin on top, so you can boil it for like 15-20 minutes. And then you get a much more potent and tasty cannabis tea. So <clears throat> if you look at what cannabis tea should be, it should be pure cannabis, and that's what this is. So I think it's, it's definitely it's lit. Yes, can. Yes, can. Yeah. And let's see what's inside the baggie, shall Just weed. Pure weed. No rooibos. No, I wouldn't <laughs> want rooibos with it. No. Don't it like surely rooibos. can't taste that lacquer, though, man. Just gave. Right? I thought it was delicious. What happens is that um, the, the stuff on the plant matter dissolves and it floats like an oil on the water. Okay. So it doesn't, it doesn't look... Sorry? It doesn't look like a, like a normal cup of tea. There's stuff floating on top, so <clears throat> some people might be put off by it. But it looks like trim, though, man. But it does. The like. trick, eh? I was very stoned and I slept like a baby. Okay. Full body That's eye. That's good trim. You can't get that stoned with a joint. You've got to have the tea or eat it. Mm -hmm. nice. Now, that's it. Nice. So, are you drinking it every night? I, most nights, like to drink some dacha tea before I go to sleep, yes. I have trouble sleeping, and that's one of the best cures for it. Sometimes I use um, skeletium as well, and valerian, both also plants that make you sleep and that calm you down. And did they say how much a jar of that costs, though? Or did it just rock up in the bag? I don't know. Where did it come from? I didn't bring it here. There was no price on that. That <coughs> just was given to us as a gift. Yeah, a gift. Well, I'm chuffed with it, and I would like to have more, so... Whoever gave it to us, please send us some more. Or I would even buy some if I could. So you rate it's lit, eh? Yes, I wish I could have the Gorilla Glue one, man. Somebody probably smoked it. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's good trim. I'm sure someone can. Yeah, it's yeah. not here. It's gone. Yeah, it's so. Is someone going to smoke some of this trim? <coughs> Let's have a look at it. You want to smoke some? Not me. Give me a fresh bag there. No, don't waste it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you use the tea bag more than once? Well. And uh, no, I wouldn't use it more than once. But uh, a bag is a lot. You can make a whole pot out of one bag. Okay. I mean, I'm yeah. quite a, a consumer of the plant. So some people might want yeah, to I mean, you know, not drink a whole bag full. Could, could make a whole pot. It could, could be four cups. Any pips, Dan? No pips. But That's good. But trim covered in trichomes. Really? Okay. Oh, yeah. Like, absolutely Screaming covered in trichomes. Oh, I told you I was stoned. <laughs> no, this is not your average trim. Let's put it that way. Okay. Like, definitely not your average trim. So, like, indoor trim? 100% indoor. It says 100% <laughs> organic. That's the only information on the label, really. That's cool. Well, that's it works, it works, Sash. Yeah. I'm not going to smoke it, though. <laughs> 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 I've got beautiful buds right next to me. I've, you know what I mean? Like, it's hard to... Yeah. Apple we take your word for it that it works. <laughs> <laughs> but it seems a bit plain Jane to me. Because, like, don't get me wrong, it's nice that it's, it's got gang weed in it. It's got dang <laughs> trim. But, you know, we're getting to a point now, like, you saw all about branding and awareness and also creating that sustainable vibe for Oaks and helping them mm. get on their way and training wheel them. It's, like, with the products as well, it can't just be weed. I now complain about when things say, like, that, that cannabis energy Actually. drink, and it's got point zero 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 fuck all in it, but it gets to call itself cannabis energy drink. I don't agree with that. But I do feel like it can't just be weed for it to be special anymore. You know? Maybe yeah. it's got to have a little rooibos, or a I'm little bit of this. I'm a tea lover. Yeah? So, 
I could vape if I want to get stoned, you know, I could take oil, I could dab, whatever, and I do. But uh, there's something about tea, you know, the flavors in it, all the, all the flavors in the plant, and it's a very complex plant with lots of flavors. There's terpenes galore in there, mm. and it's a delicious taste experience, and it's a slow sipping thing, it's not a quick thing. Um, I drink tea all day, so that's a, it's a beautiful compliment to, to all your other teas. Okay, do you think it's good enough that you could do just that? Would you give up smoking and vaping and do that exclusively? No, I enjoy all the different delivery methods when it comes to cannabis. Every now and then I even have to smoke, although smoking is not that healthy. I try to vape more. I enjoy vaping quite a bit, but you can't compare the two, you know? It's different. Fire. Always a difference. Fire is fire. Fire makes a difference. Yeah, I, cool. I also enjoy different, all the different methods. Okay. Edibles, so come on, have dabs. a cup of tea, yeah, Dad. The kettle I don't see any of it. Oh, the kettle tea. broke. The kettle broke. The kettle oh broke. my! Isn't the isn't the tap hot enough? I, I bet it is. So. <laughs> no. <clears throat> That's why I said uh, my preferred method is to boil it a little bit um, in so water and milk, rather than to just steep it and drink it. That's right. why you got super stone, is because the milk extracted. Yep. Uh, the mm. milk is a better carrier. Uh, it's, yeah. it's fat yeah. solid, so yeah, the, the cannabinoids dissolve in a fatty, hot, fatty liquid. So yeah. in water, some yeah. of it floats on top, but it doesn't all come off the plant. It needs to dissolve yeah. in a fatty liquid. Yeah. Yeah. It that's doesn't. Uh, so that's doesn't the chemistry goes. behind it. Yeah. And does it actually taste nice, or is it just it's taste delicious. nice in a it's healthy this way? Floral rainbow in your mouth and nose. Why would it not be if nice? If you saw that in the shops, would you spend money on it? Absolutely. Nice. Oh. No. It's an A product. Love so five it. roses, you fucking listening. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> five leaf. Uh, all twenty leaf. roses. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh folks. So Shoal, you're pretty much the only one who can vote on it. Lit. Yes, it's lit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not one hundred percent though, I've got one complaint. Tell so us. Let's go back. I don't know if the desk came is still on. Yeah. These are bags. really beautiful bags that it comes in, all right? But they're sort of mm. shiny and silver. They look like something you'd find at a wedding. And Gee. I feel a bit uncomfortable to put this pretty bag that looks like it may be spray painted with silver or something, <laughs> put it in hot water and then drink that water. I, I'm a bit funny like that, but that's just a personal thing. I don't know what it's made of. Maybe if it's said on the label that it's safe and made from something that doesn't scare me then I would be more at ease but I don't know what, what it is it could be plastic you know they say hot plastic is toxic yeah they need some Rizzler tea bags or something yeah. or yeah, they, must, they must just promote bag. the old school method of using like a little dunker thing mm. Mm. Uh, yeah, yes, yeah that's sustainable now sort of there. things with the holes in it uh, what I are regular the dunker get another bottle for free on wish <laughs> <laughs> what are regular tea bags made of it's a it's a paper but well, it's, it's a, a it's a um, um, well, it's basically a, a grade one paper that they utilize uh, because you can't, and it needs to be a virgin paper that they work with. Huh. So, no, they could do it out of hand, yeah. yes. But, uh, but the thing is that with something like that, if we go legal, you can't sell it like that anymore. Mm. And uh, it, it, like I agree with you, it looks very pretty, but it's not something that a lot of people would utilize as tea, they would take it out and then just dump it into the cup and yeah. try and make the tea that way because it doesn't, even when you feel the baggie, it doesn't feel kind of like something like you would put into a... Like it's not going to hold it together yeah. properly, it's going to yeah. leak. Yeah. It's a very Flower crafty material. presentation. Um, I love it, it's very practical, I keep it on the shelf and use it like that. Um, I could see it work well just like that in a private club because there you don't have to comply to certain standards. Mm. Private club, you've got your 50 or 150 people that consent to consuming the mutual products in the club and that's where this would really go down. Like a Lani Shabim. <laughs> I'd say. Very much. <laughs> so yeah, I, I agree with you though. Standardize the bags in that. So, Charles, are you sure it's a lit or a lit-ish? No, it's lit. Lit, eh? Yeah, mm. sold. My only sold. worry is with the bags, like I said. Yeah. But that's only because I don't know. I'm going to give it a try tomorrow. I'll give you the verdict next week or whatever. But I'll, I, I like a tea too. I'll give it a try and give it a real chance with the working kettle, eh? All right. But that's enough about tea. I'm going to go. See you guys. Bye. Adios, amigo, eh? Bye.